Ah, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Coffee here. And today we're back with a <laughs> unboxing. Yes. Now this unboxing, this kit came out a little bit ago, but I told you guys in the Q&A this past weekend that if you wanted to see how I put the drills back in the bag, I would show you with this kit. So here we are as promised. Now, this kit currently is 20% off on the Diamond Art Club website. So if you did not get it the first time it released, it is still available to you. So you can go ahead and run on over to diamondartclub.com and go ahead and get this if you would like to. If not, you know, the old thing is your world, boo-boo. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. We're going to go ahead and get into this plastic over here. Oh, we got to get, get into the plastic. And then we are going to take a look at this kit because I got this kit a little bit ago and I really wanted to unbox it and then I got caught up in other things. So I'm going to unbox it now. So if I can get into the box. So how are you guys doing today? You having a good day? Of course you're having a good day. You came to visit Miss Coffee. And if you're not having a good day, do something nice for yourself. You deserve it. All right. So we're going to try to get into this box. Possibly. Maybe. Struggle bus. I have learned that I am the conductor of the struggle bus. All right, so let's get all the stuff out here. Oh, it's in there, good, okay. Not that you need to put this on the box, but it does come with that sticker that you can put on the side of the box so that if you do store it away, you know exactly which kit it is, which is kind of hard to tell that which kit it is, or it's not hard to tell what kit it is because it's all over the box. So, um, we're going to put that there, and then we're going to take a look and see what minder and, and washi tape we got in our toolkit. Seems that, that seems to be the latest craze right now. So let's open this up. And of course, you get your pair of branded Diamond Art Club tweezers. Do be careful with those tweezers because they will shank you. If you don't know what that means, I don't know what to tell you. So let's see what minder and washi tape we got <gasps> oh we got this beautiful looks like fireworks gold fleckle which matches the batman logo and then we have this beautiful rose look at that isn't that pretty it's so pretty and then of course you get your boat your wax your pen your baggies and your multi-placers so we're gonna put all that stuff back in there Possibly. Okay, I'm trying to get it on top of the boat. Yeah, I don't care about the toolkit. So, let's get the rest of this stuff out the way so we can take a look and see what this kit looks like. Because I can't imagine it has a lot of colors. Because it's mostly black. At least the picture looks mostly black. So we're gonna get that out of there and get that out of there. And that's our paper that Becky now loves because it's purple. So, we're gonna shift that over there. Our drills, our schematic. Oh wow, it really isn't that big. <laughs> This I, this, I would say, is easy for a beginner because it's a lot of multi-placing. So if you're someone who's new to squares and you love Batman, I would highly recommend this kit because um, there's a lot of color blocking. A lot, a lot of color blocking. So, if you didn't know, this is a Mandy Manzino, Manzino, Manzano piece. <laughs> Sorry, Mandy. Um, so we are going to do it like that so you can take a look. Looky! Yes! Go ahead, Batman! So if you are a Batman fan, this kit might be the right one for you. And automatically, automatically, I'm seeing the bat symbol. I would go visit dpwithsparklers.com. That's T-Mall and get some glow in the dark to make this, these, and these glow in the dark. If they don't already, which I don't think that they do. But I don't know. Let's take a look. This is a 51 by 76. It is a square. So Batman by WB slash Batcare, Batman Core. Look at that. So what I'm talking about is you see the bat symbols in the background here? Even part of the moon, like the outline of the moon, I would take that outline and the Batman symbols that are in yellow and make them glow in the dark because that would look so freaking cool glowing. And then, of course, it has all your information down here at the bottom. It says it's a 51 by 76. It is a square, so y'all don't care about that. Let's get into these drills. So if you're someone who doesn't like the sound, of the person who in plastic, please meet your phone for like mm, 30 seconds or until you see me stop struggling. Now, I told you in the Q&A that the reason I do this is because I'm counting. One, two, three, curve. Oh, sorry. One, two, three, curve. So when I flip it, one, two, three. So what I'm doing is I'm counting to see how many 
drill packs are showing. So one, two, three. Now, do I get them in there perfectly just like this? No, not always. So that and I'm getting a feel for how they feel in my hand so that I know to kind of squish them down a little bit. So we are going to go ahead and get into this. And again, the reason I'm explaining this to you is in Q&A number 13. I believe it's number 13. We should be on number 14 this weekend. If you have not submitted your question to the Q&A for Saturday, it is in the community tab and also in the pinned post on my Facebook group, Crafters Anonymous with Miss Coffee. So enough of that. Here we go. Let's take, take a look at this. 317, 310, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 12, 12 bags of 310, good God. So we have 12 bags of 310 for this kit, which is not surprising because it looks like most of the kit is 310. You also have 939, double trouble, triple threat. We have four of them, five of them, six 939s. And then we have 3865 there. Get out of here. And then we have 3823, 334, 322, 803, 3766, 312, 434, and AB alert. Yes, we got that sweet going with a little bit of extra butter. So 130 is our first AB in this kit. And if you're new to diamond painting and you don't know what an AB is, don't worry. Miss Coffee got you. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's an iridescent coating that is put onto the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter. And when you lay them down on the drill or on the canvas next to regular drills, it will pick up the light from the regular drills and make them sparkle brighter as well. Because if one shines, we all shine, you heard. So our first AB of this kit is going to be 131, which of course is going to be that beautiful yellow color. And we will figure out exactly where that goes here in a few minutes. We're going to get through the rest of these drills. You ready? 413, 741. 783, 414, and eh, eh, AB alert. Yes, we have 139 as our next AB. So 130 and 139. We are going to figure out exactly where those go here in a few minutes. 414, or sorry, 415, 754, 775, 632, 407, 948, and eh, eh, AB alert. 141. So 141 is the next a, B, in this kit. And again, we're going to figure out where those go as soon as we get through the rest of these drills. So let's see. We have three bags of 823. So one, two, three. 726. We have two bags of 37.99. Double trouble there. 745. Double trouble there as well. Which you got something in here that's not practicing social distancing. And then we have 972. All right. Now. Instead of doing my usual movie magic where they go back into the bag, I'm going to show you how I did this. So, what I'm going to do, is you also want to pay attention to how they came out of the spiral that they were in. So, we're going to do the shortest bags, then the next shortest, and we're just going to line them up like this, or back to back, it doesn't matter. And then we're going to take that last bag, which is the longest one, and we're going to stack it on top just like this, okay? Okay. Now, how many bags did we see in the beginning? We saw three, right? So at that third bag, and we're gonna moment of silence for that drill that didn't make it. We're trying to practice social distancing and just didn't get there, amen. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna fold it at that third bag, just like that. See how it's already flat there? I'm gonna let that go. We're gonna fold it down again. And we're gonna keep doing that until we get to the bottom. And again, it won't put them back in there exactly how Diamond Art Club had them in there, but close enough. So that is how we have them. And they're a little bit thicker than what Diamond Art Club had, and that's okay, because then we're gonna put them in the bag. And see how nicely they fit back into the bag? And you can take your finger and kind of shuffle them about a bit so that they fit evenly on the sides and stuff. And again, it's not going to be absolutely perfect, but you'll get them back in there. And then you're just taking that bag, folding that one piece of plastic back. And I like to press them up against me. And then pull them as tight as I can to close it back because that sticky thing that holds them closed still is tacky. So I'm literally just pressing them up against me so that I can get them flat. 
Again, not as perfect as Diamond Art Club, but they're back in the bag. Boom. Now we're going to get that plastic or those drills out the way so we can figure out where these diamonds go. <laughs> All right. So we know we have three ABs because on a Diamond Art Club canvas, you're looking for numbers one or numbers that are less than 150. So we have three, 130, 139, and 141. Now these numbers are going to be represented by the numbers one, two, and three. So we already see a number one. So that, that yellow is going to be a number one. So even if you choose not to make it glow in the dark, it will be an AB. And so with this symbol here and all around the sun there or the moon, sorry. And then we have the Batman symbol over here as well. I'm Batman. Number three right here on his eyes is going to be glow in the dark. The bat symbol on his chest is going to be glow in the dark. Mm, Batman, you looking kind of thick today, buddy. All right. And then his utility belt doesn't seem to have any ABs on it, which is just fine. And then we're going to look for some more number twos over here. And then, of course, that means there have to be some more number twos over here because I do know that Mandy Manzano loves symmetry. Got some number twos here, which means we're going to have some number twos over here. Um, Let's see. Batman, you looking kind of thick, buddy. A little thickin'. So... We also have, okay, I'm going to show you where the, the ABs are. Here we go. Thank you, Erica. We have some number twos on his head. We have around the moon back here, and these little bat symbols in yellow are going to be ABs as well. We also have some ABs on his glove. So right here on his glove here and here as well. We also have some on his cuffs right here or on his forearms, I'm sorry, for the ABs. There's none really down here. You could always add like some ABs going on down here or around like the white outline around him because those are just regular drills. Um, the ABs for this kit for the number one. Um, do we see the number one? I see three. I see one. And then I saw two. So number three is the one what we're looking for. So there was threes in his eyes. But I don't remember seeing any more number threes. But there's number three right here on the edge for this sparkle. So there's a little sparkle right here that's number three and the little twinkles in the sky are also ABs. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, four, five, six, seven. So you have eight, nine. Um, you have some ABs in the background, but there's none like white wise on him. So I, I could easily see you changing like these white outlines to be number one. It is 3865 for that square. So like if you wanted to go to T-Mall and get some uh, ABs, I can see that being a cool thing to have to have him outline. And with that said, that is Batman by the WB and Diamond Art Club. So huge thank you to Diamond Art Club for providing this for us. And huge thank you to you for watching. Now, if you have any other questions, comments, or concerns about Batman, leave them down in the comments section below. Did you get this kit when it came out? If not, is it on your wish list? What, what's going on with you? Um, let us know down in the comments. Now, like I said before, when I started, when I unboxed it, or when I opened it, <laughs> this kit is currently 20% off at Diamond Art Club and it is available at the time of this recording. Now, if you come back to this video in half an hour and it's gone, I do apologize, but at the time of the recording, right when I started, I looked, it was available and it was 20% off. So get while the getting's good. But with that said, I'm out of here, folks. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any, like, it's, you know, questions, comments, concerns, leave them down in the comment section like we do. Always remember to stay caffeinated, stay crafty, stay safe. And remember to always try to be kind to others because you never know what somebody else is going through. Be courteous because it's the right thing to do. And always stay cool. Bye guys.